I'm going to make a mark in that board. Notice how I'm keeping my stuff off of the off of the ground, you know. Even though I haven't really made fire with this per se, that's the tip that's not the business part. And I'll put that on the ground, but everything else is off the ground. I'm going to take the tip of my knife, or it could be a stone or whatever. This yucca was simply a flower stalk. It's a very, very, almost like balsa wood. And it can really cause problems because of that. See that big split? I could be, it could be a done deal. This could just fracture right in half. And then I'll have to poke around and try to find, and if it gives me a real problem, I'll just try to use this same hole. You know, because again, it's, it's a really crappy piece to use, but it's a challenge. So I'm going to come over here, and I'm going to seat the drill, which means burning the hole, which means actually doing the, the hand drill itself. Notice how I'm sinking into this. It doesn't matter uh, for this aspect. It does matter when I'm making fire. So um, I'll change this up when I'm actually trying to make fire itself. So it's a downward pressure and speed. What I'm trying to do is push this stick to China and rotate it as fast as I can using the full surface area of my hands. This is very common. What you want is more of a, as full of rotation as possible. And there's a time when you can actually rotate up and actually work your way up the spindle with downward pressure. It's called the uh, floating, floating hands technique, similar to the Kung Fu Dragon Foo Dog technique. So downward pressure and speed, and spit provides that little bit of grip. And I'm just going to go for burning the hole in. And this is, again, this is a new drill that's gathered, picked up out here. So we'll see how it works. And I want to get it done pretty quick because there's not a lot of fussing around with this yucca because it's so it's so soft. I don't want to waste a lot of the wood itself seating the drill. Now this stuff, this hot dust is the bomb. You know, I always try to save that and put that in that configuration somewhere. And then here's what I have. I have that burned hole in there. Now I'm going to carve the notch in and when I'm done with that I'll pass it around. What does the notch do?